Hello, everyone. Listen. I said it before, I could definitely play this game a bunch. Um, and I did, I do have this random one that I play when I'm not streaming or recording this session. Um, but I was like, you know what, if I'm going to play something, I might as well just record it because I don't have time to stream right now, unfortunately. Today has been busy. I got to work on the game that I'm designing um, for a little bit. And let me just say, sometimes... Um, <laughs> Like, there's obviously a lot that goes into games, and I'm not even thinking about, like, sound effects or anything like that. My special- I only do art. Like, I- I am not- I'm not skilled at anything else, you guys. So, <laughs> um, I'm laughing at myself, but, um, I wish that I was, like, more savvy on things, I guess. Um... Yeah, because it is sometimes kind of, I don't know, like I've been working on this game and I think I said it's an isometric game. I don't want to talk too much about it because it's still very much in the planning stages, but being in that stage is so frustrating because in my mind I have a completed game, um, basically. <laughs> it's just getting it all out and it's something that you wouldn't see that you don't see like in this game is like the grid that everything snaps to and I kind of like that but I'm also like do I use the grid that I'm using because I'm doing isometric and so um, this is top down and you could still call it isometric it's not technically but it still has like the grid spacing um, I'm pointing to the back behind this menu by the way it's just paused for me Astro hi I don't think she understands when I talk into the microphone that I'm talking to you guys. Um, sorry. Anyway, so, um, I don't know. It's, it's just, I, you know, I'm trying to figure out, like, size-wise, if my grass is this big, how big is my character? If my character is this big, how big is the house? And I think I just needed to start with the character, because I was just sitting there for, like, an hour and a half, drawing random plants to, like, put around my plain green <laughs> um, map that I I am not gonna even call it designed I picked a green shade and I threw it down and I said I'm just gonna hand decorate this with assets is basically what I'm doing anyway you know what enough about that I think I'm gonna go for this because I want to be able to build a bigger chest and put it in my craft room I don't know that that's gonna be the goal today the goal today is definitely to collect supplies right we did say that we were going to do that we now have the ability to do this so you can see we need a lot of iron for that so we can get that going see if we have anything for the hinges we don't we did need some more nails though we'll just snag up all of those and we'll get down to chopping so we're not going to open at all today the goal is just to get this mining out of the way. We'll go visit Bob because we haven't visited Bob in a while. Um, we've got the stuff to continue decorating our tavern some more. And I think we'll even work a little bit more on decorating the tavern. We do have three gold. We'll see what Bob has for sale and decide if we're gonna have the money to do anything except visit with Bob really and if that's the case we might come back and <laughs> we might we might actually come back and open up the tavern if we use all of our money on Bob I think I finally convinced my brother to get this game. He was like, I'm waiting for it to go on sale, but this isn't a fully released game yet. Um, and I was like, I th I'm pretty sure this game is still only $15 on Steam. Get it while you can, because for $15, this is actually a ton of content already. Um, they're doing the same thing as Stardew. I'm pretty sure Stardew was $15 when it came out as well. 
and I know that he made like a million dollars that day <laughs> from selling his game. Um, so I don't know, it is crazy. And like, look what he did. If you guys look at their roadmap, honestly, the team that's working on this game is super devoted to it. Um, and I'm really excited to see where this heads. I keep I keep asking my brother, um, because he's the coder for our game, my game, our game. I'm gonna call it our game. Um, I keep asking him like, is it possible for you to do X? And he's like, Yeah, I can do that. <laughs> We're gonna want a lot of wood for today too. I'm worried. This is not gonna. enough. I think all of these are mature, though. Hi, baby. You can stay here. I don't know why you're teetering on the edge of the side platform like that. Yeah. You can sit here, my little void girl. Yes. Good girl. And I think that the team that's working on this game has done a really good job of like taking a step back and actually revising the art in this game. Because if you look at their art from their days when they first let this game be early access, um, it's way different. So good for them. It is not easy to go back through and redraw every single asset. And I don't know that they had to redraw all of them, but that's a lot. It was still a lot. I am curious why we decided that the base of a rock is literally like a sidewalk. Alright, our carrots look done, don't they? Yes, they do. And they are. Yes. Okay. We do have something else that we can plant in its place. That's corn for right now. And of course we have all of that stuff back in the uh, um, the bin over there. It's not a bin. It's chest. I think I want a lot of that. Oh, we can make our own wooden sh big shelf. Mm. That's very tempting. Okay, hang on. What are we attempting to make right now? This. Alright. So we need to come over here and make some of these, I think. How many of those do we need? Just one to make two hinges in a bunch. Okay. Let's go see Bob. And we'll mine our way down there. And I think there's some forageables around Bob, too. We'll go grab those. And on our way back, we can grab the coal that's off to that hiding spot over there. It's a very beautiful setting right here. Look at how the sun is, like, coming from the top of the screen. I love that. All right, Buzz is still not quite ready, is he? Oh no, you forgot your mother's dishes. That's terrible. Okay, it doesn't look like stuff is ready. I thought it had been quite a few days since we visited Bob, so I'm kind of sad. Bob have, Bob no have many customers. People get scared and run when see Bob. Yeah, I get that. Ooh, iron scrap. Why is that so expensive? I don't feel like I need to buy iron from them yet. Um, we could buy this iron ore, maybe? 
definitely not buying forestry waste. Can we use the egg in anything? I'm trying to think if we unlock something that the egg would be useful in. I don't think we did, so we're going to put that back. And then we're going to check. <laughs> no, no, and no. So we don't. And we can't, anyway. So we won't get the egg this time. Oh! Sorry. <laughs> Pet the chicken. Little nugget. Love it. I love them so much, guys. Alright. We don't have any of these trees. None of these trees have grown back. I wonder how long it takes for the trees to grow back. So on the farm, you do have this rock spot right here that you can, of course, um, harvest. You can grab all the forestry waste around the place if you wanted to spend the day running around out here doing this. There's also these two rocks here. And like I've said, eventually you will feel like you're hurting for rocks. So I'm really glad they added some more spots for the rocks to actually pop up. We used to just have the one spot. It literally just used to be the area around the tavern. Which was, you know, it was fine. It was okay. This is way better, though. I think we can all agree. Oh, we forgot to check our spot. We gotta go down here and check this weird spot down here. Where they're cool. I'm not going for these small ones. Um, I probably should because they take less to hit and they usually give you as much as the one size up rock, which I don't quite understand. I don't know, it just, this, I love this area. I like all the little mushrooms and everything like that. I wish that I could light this campfire, and now I'm wondering if somebody shows up here. And, because there's definitely things in this game that I haven't seen yet, and I don't, that either is like, somebody shows up there, or like, you can do something down there, like maybe there's a storyline down there. I don't know. Alright, I also think if I shred away all of this stuff here, I might be able to get some more trees to fall into place down here. Okay. That's what I want, is more trees. Get this hinge going. And while we wait, we can plot some more land. Okay, so that's right next to it. And so I want, like, here, hang on, here, yes, okay. That's not what I did, guys. So, um, I still have both of the cat trees in my room because, um, I built my cats a new cat tree and... They are both going back and forth between the two. Dusk has finally settled on the bottom um, of the new cat tree, which I'm really happy with. Um, but Ash very much is attached to the old one for some reason and has found a not even a piece of like it or anything relevant to that cat tree. She has a piece of trash. I um, try not to spoil my cats because I witness this behavior on the regular. Um, I think any cat parent can probably relate to this. Um, why is it that, like, I I could get them all the cutest little mice. Dusk loves to play fetch with the mice toys. So we get those. I get the little, you know, rat on a stick thing or whatever with the cute little tail that flips around. And Dusk loves that. She literally does flips in the air for that thing. She loves that thing. Ashdor, though, Ashdor finds the twilliest piece of, of garbage on my floor. This is probably from me building the new cat tree. And she is, like, ecstatic. There's nothing in there. Okay, thank you. Ooh, okay. 
we'll be okay. We definitely need that chest that I was talking about, though. Okay. I like it. Let's get a chest made. Oh, we need more hinges. Okay. That was my bad. I had the ability to make them in everything, and I just didn't. Yep, that's exactly what happened. I really wish that you could bulk add these materials into here. You can't, like, hold shift and do it. Alright, we do have quite a few wood. I think I am going to use some of them to make a big... I don't know why that costs so much. That's a lot for it to cost, actually. Like my planks. <laughs> Here we go. Um, I kind of feel like I'm gonna I wanna plant some more. Let's see where what can I order also? Um We have some hops down there. We don't have any trees that we can buy yet. Let's see, what else do we have in here? Okay, wheat seeds. Okay. Let's double check here. We can make mead soup and cup of tea. I should have looked at that earlier. Let's make sure we have some honey. We do. We'll get a little bit more. I'm going to grab bread yeast just because who knows when that's going to be very popular. Okay, we'll buy these few things. Our cat almost really loves us. That's nice. All right, so hit our H button and mead hops. Um, what are we missing for that? An empty barrel. Okay, hang on. We can fix that. We can fix that. Unless we only have two, in which case we might not be able to. Oh no, we'll be fine. I thought I had three buckets. That's kind of disappointing. Not gonna lie. Did I pull that out of there? Okay, it did pull. Alright, so we need a hops mead. Which I don't think is normal. And I don't think it specified what kind of hops it wanted in there. Um, and it doesn't matter how many hops you get in there, it'll get the hops effect. Okay, so we can do a CD soup. This is, I think I mentioned this last time. So we go to our soup, and we have some leek seeds. We do have extra corn seeds, though, so I think I'll use those. And um, we're really doing vegetable soup here. And our last thing would be a cup of tea with honey. And all of those things, except for maybe the brew, will be done this day. So that is nice. Um... I get that. All right. And then I totally butchered how many planks I had. My bad. Get some more, I guess. And we can run up to the top, I think. Because I think we can, um, well, we could chop some of these trees still here. We got two growing right next to each other right here. I love how green and lush this space is. That's the other thing I'm struggling with. Um, probably, if you've heard me talk before, it's because I'm colorblind and green really gives me trouble. But I love this color green. I can, I feel like I can pretty clearly see this green. And it's not necessarily green that I have an issue with. It's um, a blue, bluer green. Um, and it's specifically like shading anything with blue. So. For some reason, it kind of gets me going with the, the green, though, also. Uh. Hello. Who's think fair? Okay. 
I'm sure. I'm sure it affects all of you equally as much. All right, cool. Our order is there. Um, our soup should also be ready. It's really nice to not have to run around and answer to everybody. And with any luck, the mead will be done tonight. We can get that barrel going. And... Oh, it would be good to make our own barrels so that we don't have to order any. We might order some. Also, if you guys are wondering, this is Pharaoh. He's stuck in the ice. But I feel like two... Two things when you have four taps is not enough. Um, we should probably have eight. Although uh, right now we're kind of operating with just two. Just fine. So I think that if we had four total and we only put two out, um, that, would, that might work just fine. It might be enough. Grab this copper too. I'm really excited to see what's higher up. There's just so much potential here. <laughs> I want to see what's coming. I was in the beta for a little while, but um, I don't think they really want you to stream in the beta, so. And if any of the devs see this and they're like, no, it's fine, you know, let me know. I'll jump back into beta happily. I loved seeing the new stuff. Okay, so there's a turkey down here that we could go beat up. Um, I'm okay with calling it for mining up here. Calm down, sir. Um, that These might just be like spots where re weeds pop up. Honestly. They seem to really show up <laughs> when they want to. <laughs> um, we don't have space. <laughs> okay. Make our big chest. Go back inside. Instead of dealing with everything in there, um, we will build. So I got another large... shelf for better or for worse i guess because it's looking a little bit too big now something i am doing in my other game right now i noticed is that i do take down the candles at night it doesn't i mean i lost a day with them right now but it it's not going to make a huge difference i feel like not i guess not a big enough one that it's like you should definitely make sure you fix that kind of a thing. Oh, I didn't realize I didn't have tea leaves. Do I have the option to get tea leaves anywhere? Definitely not there and not here either. Hmm. So we can delete that. We can't do it. So it goes back over here. It's just going to disappear tomorrow. You'll always need planks, so I would always be making that happen. All right, so this chest is going to help us so, so, so much. Uh, let's do that. And I guess we can also drop our stuff here. That'll give us a few more spaces. Okay. 
So... Uh oh, it's not letting us place. Hold on. We do our little thing. There we go. Okay, so we place this in our crafting room, which means that in the crafting room, everything that's in here that has to do with the crafting stuff, um, we do have access to. So, we really want to put things in here that we will use for crafting in particular. So, all of our ingredients. I do not store seeds in this. Um, I don't know if other people do. I just, I don't. Speaking of which, how'd that get in there? <laughs> um, we can store some stuff in here, though, if we really need to. So I can put the seeds in there for now. Love to see this beautiful little stack right here. Really wish there was a faster way to organize this. Oh, there is. Good. Okay, so we can go plant those. We got our shining candle holders. I forgot we made those. That's good. We should get those on the tables while we have this day to do that. And so you can watch. We're at 92 now. We're going to keep going up little by little <laughs> as we put these on here. And the candle goes in there. It's just one dinky little candle that sticks up, but um, you know what? It's our one dinky little candle, so there. And for the time being, we can't make the gold-looking candelabra, so we're kind of stuck. Um, was that enough to make this? Let's make an oil lamp, too. We've got a little bit of time. You know, we could go until two. I'm okay with that. An individual table. We could do two small benches if we did that. What were we at for our... <coughs> 23 is our maximum occupancy. Not bad. Let's see. 6 and 6 is 12. 18. So we can definitely fit in another table. We don't have enough for that. We definitely don't have enough for that. What is a low table? Oh, interesting. Okay, yeah. So that's obviously something that's definitely better off if you craft it yourself there. Let's see. So you need a total of 95 wood planks to craft everything that you need for a large table setup. That's a lot of tree. I don't think that one's full. I think this one is. It might not be though. I'm just gonna hit a few more trees. Now I'm nervous. Unfortunately, I do think that this is the only space that we have for trees. So use it wisely. And I love that you can just click. Just just click. You don't even have to be near the spot. You just click and he plants it. All right. We will head inside. We'll grab our last little ingredients. And tomorrow we will be open. Marceline is doing pretty good, it looks like. Oh, and here's our brew also, so we've got that. We won't be able to make anything, though. We'll have to wait until tomorrow, because I don't want to risk running outside and coming back in and passing out, so. Okay, here we go. Now for this day. So this day we'll try to do a super full day. kitty cat. Um, come out here. We'll deliver the mead first so that we can get another thing going for that. Okay, and you can see we have a bunch of things there. We don't have the ability to do any of this stuff, so we're not going to do it. Um, did we get a reset, actually, of food today? No, we did not. Okay. 
Just checking. Alright, we do have this. Let's see, can we make a barrel? We can make an empty keg. We need two more pieces of... Okay, wow, that's not actually a lot. I am okay with that. Before I continue doing that, I'm going to double check this area here. Look at that. Look at all that we can do. We could haggle a better price. Um, we could have our farming yield go up. That would be good. We'll actually just take all these first ones here. Um, this is really good because if you look at it, our crafting yield is going to go up another 10% here. Um, hmm. I think I want that and haggling. You can read what they all do. Um, take your pick. Sometimes then though, like I could come in here and it might say two next to one of these things. Or I think, I don't know if you can eventually craft more. I'm sure you're supposed to be able to um, for some of these things. Yeah, see like the wooden planks go up. I can now craft six instead of the five I think that we were doing before. We don't need another brewing barrel necessarily yet. All right, let's get to mining resources at least today and then we will open up. Even though we don't have the next set of benches that we wanted. Look at how our little saplings just sprouted right up. See how much taller this one is from this one? That's how you can tell this one's full grown. This one's a lot smaller, I think, than the one I cut down yesterday that I was debating if it was full grown, so I feel better now. So definitely right now in the early game, it feels like we cannot afford to stay closed for more than a day. Well, even being closed a day was not the best idea, right? Deal with that, like that. See, now watch this. I'm going to get like six wax out of this. Sometimes I only get two pieces of copper, though. This is giving me a lot more. I, maybe I'm thinking of like these two over here for iron. Sometimes they really get me. I mean, it's a good decoration, I guess. Alright, I like that our crafting, now we're crafting more than before. That's really nice. Okay. Oh, look, we can do this. Okay. We'll want to make some more and some iron nails. Okay. But we have enough to make at least another empty cake if we can spare the fuel, which we can.
Alright, I'm gonna go ahead and set these candles in here. And we'll hit O, but we're also gonna go order some more candles, because that looks like a low amount of candles to me. Maybe I'm a little bit too nervous because of Graveyard Keeper, but I'm okay with being a little too nervous. Hi, person. I'll be right with you. Oh, what am I missing? The barrel. Right, of course. Wait, when I turned in the mead, did I not... I'm so confused. Did I lose the cake? No. What? Okay. Oh, wait. He's asking for something that I already have pulled. Good deal. We're so popular. We definitely do a good job of filling up our seats. Oh, we missed a candle. Hang on. We get our candles all in there. There we go. Oh, this place is going to look nice. All right, we've got another barrel. I think we can do another one. Let's go. Cool. And they don't take too long to craft, so that's really good. So now instead of waiting for those two to come um, finish out, we can do, 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 do one of these two. Um, we should make a dark ward too, actually, though. So this is split right now because I have some in my pockets from when I harvested, and I have some in the chest, so um, that's a good reminder to go drop off all those ingredients. All one of those ingredients, that one set of ingredients that you guys totally remember we have. Okay, go plant these little seeds too here. Oops. So funny enough, I think I can place this guy on my shelf still, even though we're open. All right, we'll give all the tables a really quick rub down. Yeah, nobody will come in, I don't think, while you have people at the counter, so make sure you serve your guests at the counter, too. Alright, these guys can come in and be a little bit upset that I'm going to run outside, though, and plant something. There we go. Oh, and we can grab our other keg. So our one thing will finish brewing, and then this will... Um also get something brewed into it. The thing is, is we'll, um, we'll do our best to remember <laughs> that we have a little chest, perhaps, with kegs of, of brew in them. Okay, we only have, um, 64 porridge. Let's get some more porridge going. Oh, I don't want seeds in there. I want actual barley. Thank you. Oh, and we can get a dark wart. Uh, let's do that. Okay. But our cat is over there on the wall. It's fine. It's totally normal. We need to remember to plant those. Now, unfortunately, when it comes to placing a chest out here, um, these spots will not share chests. 
So you do have to pick one or the other to put um, all of your stuff into. Okay, so we ran out of wood there. Kind of a big deal. Big, big worry there with that. Yeah, get out. Go on. Go on, then. I'm doing a really good job here, okay, sir? I don't need you criticizing me. Oh, these poor people, though. They're eating at a really dirty table. Yeah, I see you. I see you all getting really gross. Calm down. Probably pull some more of that. Absolutely, you know, whatever you want. Make another uh, vegetable one. There we go. You know, so far a pretty good day of being open. We've got one gold in there. We've made quite a bit, actually. Because I'm pretty sure we spent almost all of our silver before the day started. So, um, good for us. Alright, and I think that's actually good for what all I want to make for food right now. What is that, two more porridges? So, we're pretty good porridge-wise, mead-wise, we're good. So the quests do ask you for things that you cannot make yet, and so you just have to just be aware of what you can and cannot do. Um, we can't really make all of those, so let's actually look at cooking. So I'd almost rather be able to make more money with cooking for the time being. Okay. We could unlock laggers, though. Yeah, we could. And those, and those. No? Okay, JK. I thought we had another green one left. Okay, look, so now we can actually make, like, proper roasted food. So we can actually just pick, like, oh, we have some fish. Let's just make some fish with, like this. Then we'll make some fish dishes. A fish dish! Wonderful. 66 reputation from them. 64, 62. And oh, we'll take it. Oh, it's him down there. Okay. 70. Good deal. We got up into 70. That's awesome. Right. Go grab this and get something else brewing in here. Um, we have enough for a lager. I wanted to make a porter though. So let's do that. We'll go with some bitter peach for that one. Let's make a roasted chicken. We do a little honey and garlic roasted chicken with some carrots, maybe. That sounds yummy. 
They do not have to sound good, by the way. You can literally, if it offers you that ingredient, you just put it on there. You do not have to be realistic in the slightest if you don't want to be. Okay, so we are going to take this risk here where we pull that whole thing and we put this mild ale in there instead. Um, and that is just so I have access to that empty keg now. And we'll pull a few of these and stick them in our book as well. I love that this game has remote play, but my brother literally asked me even if like we could play this game together. I freaking wish. I would love for that to be a reality. Oh, we're running low on soup now. That's impressive. Mild ward. Oh, we need some water. Okay, we can go get water. Yeah, we need water for like everything. Okay. Oh, okay. All right. Oh, okay. Okay. We just showed up. Dude. Really? Really, dude? Really? Like, I know I don't have a bathroom, but like, excuse you? I'm pretty sure I have a bathroom. Okay. I haven't seen one. I'm okay with that, by the way. I don't really want to manage a bathroom, also. Woohoo! Oh, I didn't harp. <laughs> I need to go mine that iron over there. What the heck am I doing with my life? Somebody else here? Professor Snape? Alright, let's clean up this floor. Hardly even see this little mess over here. Right, we're getting three silver at a time sometimes here, which is really good. We, can we see trends? Oh, not yet. Right. All right, and then we couldn't really make any of this. Oh, did we not turn in our... Guys, that's what happened. We made a mead, and it didn't take it? Or did we not make a mead then? I'm so confused. Did I or did I not? Well, anyway. How did I get this but not... Oh, not finish that. I have one more hit on it. Okay. Sure. I think we're good there. We got our water, so let's make some more stuff here. What am I missing for this? Oh, some malted barley. I'm making it now. And I did unlock bread, so actually we could um, use the grinder real quick here. So if you turn that on too early, sometimes people will be like, it's too hot in here. But they didn't complain. They're good. She took off in the other direction. I wasn't ready for that. That's not fair. 71, 74. Wait, this has been a good episode so far. I really like the longer format. I think I've, like I said, at the beginning of this episode even, I could play this game for hours. Like, if there was an interest to see this game streamed on YouTube instead of on Twitch, um, I would be there for it. so nervous that I don't have any more wood, actually. Um, 
this looks fully grown. What are you guys doing up here, standing in Gradu? Alright, a lot of people like in the porter right now, I guess. I wonder if you can uh, take note of that and base your popular food items on that stuff. I'm coming around, I'm coming around. I'm sorry, I did get behind. I had to go mine some extra things out there. So sorry. Our cat seems very happy these days now. Yes, it's so tidy and it's well lit, okay? I got standards here. Oh, I forgot to put those things up in there. Ooh. Hopefully we can make some extra money with that stuff. Oh, I forgot to get lights for this area, too. We really need lighting back here. It's very dark. <laughs> okay. Um, let's do... I guess let's do mead. No. Isn't that what we needed? Was mead with honey? What? How is it saying honey, but then not offering me honey? Do you guys see this? It says we need honey, right? Yes. Got that. But. Oh, it's hops. <laughs> it's hops need. Right. Okay, I got this. I got this. I got it figured out, y'all. We'll get a dark wart then, since we don't have a dark wart. Oh, I'm so sorry. I really thought I served you. Oops. What? How did I miss him? Yeah, get out of here. Also, he had to make a mess on his way out, really? Listen, dude, I'm I'm I'll be right there, okay? Calm down. Tap your foot. Yeah, just sit there tapping your foot then. Yeah, there we go. That's what I thought. Oh, okay. Wow, some of this sells actually really high. I'm very glad for that. Get out. Put this porter in there. Alright, we'll serve these two guys here. Oh, and this guy, I guess, also. Oh, okay, and all of these guys here. What the heck? Where did these people come from? I'm trying to close! Boiled. Okay, there we go. Y'all, y'all could see that I really had to serve all those people, right? Like, we didn't have a choice. We absolutely had to help all of those guests that just walked in. Four gold for it, though. And, do we get level five? I don't think we're going to make it to level 5. I am so sorry. That's kind of a bummer. I was really hoping to make it to level 5. Not going to lie. We're so close to. Well, next episode. A little, little something to look forward to. Episode. Episode. What about be? 6, I think. Um, let's make a little more fish. Always want to have something going. Before you close down for the night. Um, I guess we'll go for a regular. And yeah, you know what? Why not? Our cat. Good deal. Make sure everything is good down in here. We can turn off our fire, save some 
um, firewood there. Okay. I think that's all that we need to do for today. All right. Thank you guys so much for joining me on another episode of Traveler's Rest. Um, definitely recommend you guys check this game out if you are interested. Um, you can find it on Steam. Thank you so much for joining me. I will see you guys in the next episode.